Hey guys, so I wanted to talk to you today about using a hi-hat. Now a hi-hat is beneficial when you don't have a lot of space for a tripod. You do have a lot of counter space. So let's say you're uh, in the kitchen cooking and you want to get some counter shots. Uh, so you can use this device, it's called a hi-hat. Now it doesn't come with everything that you need out of the box. So you will need to get several different pieces to make this thing work. But I have linked them all in the comments below. So uh, please go down there and check out those links. That way you can build this setup. Basically what I'm going to show you today is how I use this in the kitchen to get several different shots. I'm using the Sony FX3 right now to um, film this, but I'm also using this in the kitchen as my main primary camera. Um, I used to have an A6500, which you'll see uh, in the some of the test shots, but keep in mind I had to shoot the test shots um, with the fx3 but i had to use the a6500 when demonstrating so that's where you'll see a difference in the footage but for the most part all of the test footage was shot with the sony fx3 on either a 50 millimeter lens or the sigma 105 art macro lens so the hi-hat that i'm using is is by a company named benro and when you get the hi-hat you'll get piece of it but you're gonna also need another piece that, that doesn't really come with it. and I didn't realize that until after I purchased it I should have read a little bit deeper but I'll link in the comments all the pieces you'll need to get this up and running now the hi-hat itself is pretty uh, pricey compared to something like the Manfrotto uh, smaller uh, tabletop tripods that you might see but the benefit of using this one is the legs are sturdy, uh, the locking points are, are very accurate. Uh, you can adjust it in many different heights and you can also get it pretty much flat to the ground. So I love this uh, hi-hat. I love this as a, a tripod. It works in so many different ways, especially in the kitchen, especially in places where you can't get a big, huge tripod or a big C stand in there. This is a nice tool to have in your kit. 